Welcome to EFOX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Kenyan mothers, or rather people who believe they are well conversant when it comes to babies, really came hard at Diana Bahati. We'll be getting into that shortly. Let's start with some good news. Bahati had shared a photo of baby Malaika in hospital and Diana the same as well. And so they shared that the baby had been in hospital for the past three days. As you can see, baby Malaika has been admitted at Comorock Modern Hospital for the last three days now and we are praying that the angel gets well soon. May God's healing be upon you, my daughter, Malaika Bahati. Diana also shared some images of her holding her daughter, as you can see right now on your screen, updating their fans that the baby is doing well right now. As you can see, wrapped up in love and care, I'm recovering pretty well here, Comorock Modern Healthcare. And so that's some good news. The baby is doing good. There's improvement and probably pretty much soon they will be discharged to go home. And so let's get to the online aunties. They decided to call out Diana Bahati saying that she has been taking slimming teas. She has not been breastfeeding her child well and that's why the child is sick. I mean, children get sick all the time and it doesn't have to mean that they are not being breastfed. Some people really came to Diana Bahati's defense calling these people out for mom shaming her. Basically, that is mom shaming. And as you can see, somebody wrote here, Diana, please stop leaving your kid with nanny for a trip. She's still young, quick recovery, Malaika. And somebody puts out here, surely Sasa Mnataka Kusema, that's why she's sick. I don't think that's a problem. As long as she's in good hands, she's fine. And somebody even wrote here, I was looking uh this comment. Yes, Katoi Nikadogo. So they feel that Diana Bahati should not be out there. And uh, somebody says, yes, social media aunties have started with unsolicited advice. Someone else said here, Simamake alikuwa kwa foina juzi, meaning bahandyo akona mtoi hosi. Someone else said here, can breastfeeding mothers give their kids first priority? You can't give birth today and after one week you are going to gym and taking slimming tea. Do you care about your kid really or you care about your body shape? And the Leni Kulisha Watoto formula, Msahau God has a reason of creating milk from mothers quick recovery baby and as you can see this is somebody who strongly believes that baby malaika was sick because she is not being breastfed or diana bahati is going to the gym she's taking slimming tea allegedly i think for those who have followed diana bahati will say that uh, there's this slimming tea that she does uh advertise and some of these photos that she posts have been repeated as well I don't know what to think about it guys but i think it might be very harsh to judge a mother based on a photo she might have shown a product but doesn't mean that she's taking it during breastfeeding everyone knows that a woman who is breastfeeding nursing a child shouldn't be taking slimming tea unless maybe the mother has completely stopped uh, nursing. So somebody says here, Nizile Masafari Zenyu Hata Mtoi Hawezi Nyonyeshwa. So you can see many people believe that baby Malaika got sick because of breastfeeding. Somebody replied to this milk supply thing. As you can see, girl, her milk supply was too low. In fact, her kuwa namaziwa totally for your information. Laika doesn't breastfeed. She's surviving with baby formula. Milk supplier D. Ilisha Kitambo Sana. She talked about it on her last vlog. Somebody says, Itakata kuisha aje kama anatumia slimming tea. I'm not judging. And somebody responded here, very true. Milk supply haitaki mzururo. Ni kutulia nyumbani na kukula Sawa, sawa. And somebody here came to Diana Bahati's defense. Watu mko hapa o oh, masafari o oh, kuacha mtoto na nani fungeni midomo kwani ni yeye wa kwanza kuacha watu wakienda shughuli. So watu wasifanye mambo yao kwa sababu mtoto ni mdogo ama nyinyi mlipoza watoto wenyu hawakuwahi kuwa wagonjwa. Hizi ujinga mnaongea hapa hazi make sense. Na kila mtu akalishe akalishe matako ya matako ale wake mpaka miaka kumi hamtapangia watu maisha someone else says here Diana please stop leaving your kid with nanny for a trip she's still young quick recovery malaika and so you can see mothers or even women were very harsh towards Diana Bahati 
I think no mother wants to hear that their child was sick because of them or because they were out there. Probably baby Malaika was sick for a totally different reason that has nothing to do with breastfeeding. I honestly think what you get to see here is women shaming women who do not breastfeed enough, women who perhaps go back to work, women who have their babies taking formula. What about the women who died during childbirth and their children? are totally not breastfed and they are very very healthy i think this situation is very difficult to judge the reason why the baby became sick the parents have not shared why the child was sick they have not shared what the child got sick from but online aunties already reached to the conclusion that the baby was sick because diana bahati was not breastfeeding enough anyway that's what's happening you're up to date thanks so much for watching subscribe if you haven't hit the notification bell so you're notified once you have any new uploads i'll see you on the next one bye bye